Chinese New Year at Xi'an Garden in Richmond. Families are eating together, some dressed in lucky red, and the selection of traditional New Year's dishes is huge. To celebrate with food and have exuberance and plenty, it's very important for uh, during the Chinese New Year. Uh, before Chinese New Year, you have a, a reunion dinner. Everyone's in the house, everyone's safe, everyone's good, and you celebrate with food. And then after New Year's, you have a, a kind of kicking off meal, and you, it's about giving yourself good wishes and good luck for the, for the rest of the year. And some of that luck and good wishes is symbolized in the foods eaten during Chinese New Year. These are uh, mochi sesame balls, uh -huh. and they symbolize money. They're oh, golden yeah. and round, and so you always have stuff that symbolizes money and wealth and sweetness. And so uh, this is something that you always eat during Chinese New Year. So some of the really traditional dishes are going to be things like the dried oyster and the sea moss, which is uh, fa choy ho si. And so fa choy means, sounds like fa choy, which is rich and get rich, lots of prosperity. And ho si is good things, good things happening to you. So it's a, it's a very symbolic dish of, of money and good prosperity and good fortune coming your way in the following year. You always, almost always have a, a whole chicken. You want a whole chicken because it represents good beginnings and good endings. Again, it's deep fried to a nice golden hue, so it's golden New Year. <laughs> We're very money focused on Chinese well, New Year. Everything tastes good when it's deep fried, so. Yeah, you can't go wrong. They'll have lots of little puddings like this called go, and go means better, kind of advancement. So this lean go means this year will be better than next year, and next year will be better than the last year. So it's all about better and better and better and better every year. Xi'an Gardens award-winning chef Wing Liung joined us to celebrate. So he is really one of the most highly thought of chefs in the city, real master chef. And this year at the HSBC Chinese Restaurant Awards, he won two awards, uh, one for a lobster dish and one for a pork dish. And those are very competitive categories, so you know they must have done really well. Plenty of food, great people, the bustle of a busy Richmond restaurant, Chinese New Year is a festive occasion. Really, celebrating Chinese style is easy. Gather your family around, have the best food you can, serve things whole, which mean you know, good beginnings and good endings, and just enjoy yourself with your family. That's what really Chinese New Year's is all about. In Richmond, I'm Kendall Harris for The Express.